co-produced Lil Wayne's uh, Famous off the of Carter Five, uh, co-produced it with a uh, good friend of mine, Sock Passe. Um, the whole uh, record started with like a it was a it was a hook um, that uh, songwriter Sam Bruno wrote. She had this really cool hook, and it was like a, to to um, it's like a rough piano part. Welcome was, to your name in lights, all the letters in the sky. So we took that um that uh that vocal acapella and just added these pianos to it, which came out really cool. Just kind of give it like a real um mood and just intimate experience. draft of the beat so it actually ended up going through a few different like steps and like vibes to get it to where it really was um i think the next sound we added was this is kind of bass sound from this profit uh vintage board and it had a nice little texture under it like some really cool intricate details in the beat that just kind of snuck off in there um this is really cool vocal part that's i really like uh so like i said i love sampling myself i always find a way to end up on the track um so it's just like little as, as the piano going <laughs> i think there's a part of the song where it's like solo <laughs> so you hear like lil wayne rapping and you hear ace in the background just like <laughs> it's kind of cool. I just love like vocal samples and stuff. And then there's also this other cool texture, uh, like um, just kind of just I, I'm just a knack for like taking vocal stuff and just like. So when you put that all together, um, also there's, also there's obviously a pad just to kind of layer it and kind of give us a foundation. It's a pad here um, that played with the piano. Kind of give it an eerie feel. I love that last note at the end. It's always like it's like a modulation of notes and melody. Um, and then I think one cool signature sound on the hook is um, the piano chord is kind of reversing um, and playing the same chords, each chord being reversed on each stab. You can... When you put all those sounds together, you kind of have like a cool music bed that sounds more like this. Done like five times, so I think I think Sakpa say kept my kick and some of my percussion, but he like altered the snare a little bit. I think it's cool. Obviously, it has it like swing to it and it like bounce. Um, but yeah, I think we changed the snare up a little bit, so. Yeah, in a nutshell, that's pretty much it. It's a really simple beat. And once, once we got the acapella and I started to play that piano, um, I think that kind of set the tone for the record and just created that intimate experience where um, obviously what he's conveying in the song matches the music and he kills it. So really proud of this track. <laughs>